Well, as we take a live look on our first alert, fair, fair live radar, as you can see, cloud cover still out there a little bit, starting to see a little bit of some clearing out there, but temperatures remaining in the mid to upper 60s. And as we go through today, we're still going to be warming into those mid to lower 80s. I'll look for around 83 here in the Savannah area. Still scattered shower chances. Those will really be what determines our high temperatures, because like we talked about, they could come into our western areas as early as 1 o'clock, but pretty much going to be looking at anywhere from mid to lower 80s, lower 80s in our northern areas and then 70s for anyone who's going to be out in Hilton Head, Tybee Island, out towards the beaches. But once again, tracking out what our rain chance could look like today, it's pop up scattered showers. That's what we're pretty much going to be looking for. Higher chances for Savannah going to be closer to sunset and then we'll continue tracking those chances all throughout the overnight and on into the start of tomorrow. But jumping into what your weekend's going to look like, it's all because of this cold front. It's going to be diving into the area, so temperatures will be cooler tomorrow by Sunday. High temperatures only around 60 degrees. Luckily, we're going to gradually start warming back up as we head into next week, but definitely a cooler and definitely a wetter uh, Easter weekend is going to be on the way as we head into the next few days. But going into tomorrow, those scattered showers and storms still going to be around through the morning. Could see a little knoll where we don't see as much in the afternoon. If you have any Easter egg hunts planned, that's when I'll recommend that you do that because then we'll have more of those scattered rain chances coming in through the rest of the evening and on into the overnight through the start of Easter Sunday. Rain chance wise, though, as we head into the rest of the weekend and on into next week. Notice those rain chances go right back up heading into next weekend. We should see a little bit of a knoll as we head into next week, but one thing to take note of when it comes to Easter, 25 to 30 mile per hour gusts all around the area. This is looking right around noon when you get out of church and pretty much what we'll be looking at during that time is starting temperatures on Easter going to be around 49 degrees. We'll be seeing 56 by noon and then upper 50s as we get closer to that five o'clock hour, but that high pressure comes back in and that's what's going to help warm us back up as we head into next week. 68 degrees on Monday, 70s return by the time we get into the midweek with more rain chances looking to come in on the horizon. But let's go ahead and take a look at your traffic this morning, let you know what you should.